Hi guys, so today I'm going to be showing you some of my art pieces from when I was in high school and pre-high school, I think. Um, I have my portfolio and my sketchbooks. Uh, okay, so these were from like, I don't know, I think, let's see. Alright, so this is when I first started drawing. My friend Amanda, like, taught me how to draw and like, draw like anime characters. And this is, this is like, the very first drawings that I did, so don't like, judge me, okay? So, this was, let's see, I think I wrote on the back. Oh yeah, right here. Okay, so this was 2005, so I think I was a freshman in high school. So, they progressively get better. So, this is the first one. This is the second. They all, like, look the same, just, like, different, like, colors. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Skip that one fast. Oh, dear. Yeah, this was 665. And that was, like, two days later. I think I was drawing, like, trying to draw every single day. Yeah. Get these out of the glare. Wait, how do I get the glare out? Wait, how does this... Okay, there we go. Alright. I'm not sure what this girl was. Oh, I had a colored version of her. Um, he has a big cheekbone. Holy crap. I just, like, made these up in my head. Some of them I got reference photos from online. This one was, I think, Amanda Drew for me. I used to wear Hollister all the time, so... <laughs> Hollister on the shirt. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah. Weird shaped face girl. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what the heck? Like, what is that belt? Like, why is there circles on his belt? <laughs> it looks like he's like a disco person or something. Oh my gosh. What was this? <laughs> oh, wow. I think this is when I first started playing WoW, so I was like, oh, let me draw like this night elf looking character. Yeah, this was... 2006, okay. Oh, freaking Kiki's delivery, probably. <laughs> Look at the broom. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. Oh, this was from Kingdom Hearts. I remember this. Um, yeah, that was Kingdom Hearts when you turn, the second one when you can turn into the lion. Oh, wow. Her, her head is too small for her body. This is supposed to be Naminé from Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, nope. Oh, this is when I got good. This is when I kind of got better. Okay, so a big change. Um, this was Riku from uh, Kingdom Hearts as well. Started to get the hang of drawing. And then, I think this was, let's see, 7 4 2006. Oh, this is from, oh my gosh, I completely forgot her name, but she's from Inuyasha. Dang it, I forget her name. Oh well. Uh, this was drawn for me. This is a better version of Naminé by my friend Amanda. And then, I'm not sure what this girl was from. Shut up, this is not from Chobits. I would, I'm gonna die. I probably got a reference photo and I was just like, looking at it. Because in Chobits they have this, but it just might be something from, in like, Japan that's popular. Wow. Uh, this was Naminé again. I had like, the biggest crush, anime crush on Naminé. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, I'm not sure what this was from. I actually drew this before Tack, The Power of Juju came out, and this kind of, like, reminds me of him. And that was my last one. I stopped drawing in two, 2006, the end of 2006. So then, in high school, I did drawings. Oh, actually, what's in this sketchbook? I actually don't want to know. What is this girl? No. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. Moving on. Nothing in this sketchbook to see. Uh, so in high school, we I took drawing classes and painting classes, and this is when I actually like got a little bit better. So um, they gave us these books, and I think they wanted us to draw hands and stuff. I think it's just like basic stuff that you learn. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is funny. We had to draw our own hands. So I told my teacher, I was like, so... I just cut my nails, so, like, do I, can I still keep it like this? And she's like, oh, um, yeah, sure. Like, <laughs> she was so freaked out. Oh, uh, what else? I don't, yeah, just more hands and just, like, stuff, a skeleton key. I was obsessed with skeleton keys in high school. Uh, 
Oh, we had to draw trees. These are our sketches of my tree. This one you'll see in a minute. Um, colored pencils. Oh, dear. Terrible, terrible. Oh, is this charcoal? Yep. <laughs> still there. Still fresh. Okay. I was not a fan of charcoal. Just because it, like, it would just smudge all the time. Oh, we had to do koi fish things. I think I still have... No, I kept mine there because I hated it. Okay. So, moving on to the fun stuff. The paintings and stuff from high school. Now, this is... I, I, I enjoyed watercolor and, like, acrylic the most. So let's go through and see what we find. Okay, so I'm not sure what order these are going to be in. I'm just going to show you. So this was my watercolor drawing. We had to draw a flower. And so I drew a rose. And it's this is all watercolor with Sharpie and stuff. So, yep, there's that one. Uh, let's see what else we got in here. Okay. Oh, I hated this one. This was like, you had to draw a, um, an instrument from something, and I, I picked the, I don't even know what that's called. Sorry there, but you had to like, I don't know. I don't even freaking know, but I didn't even finish it. So, there's that. What else we got in here? What's in here? Okay, here we go. <sighs> oh, this was for graphic design. We had to make popcorn boxes. So this was a picture of my popcorn box, flattened. Oh. Yeah, I wasn't really good at my graphic design class, but this was for a Museum of Fine Arts. It, we had to do like a logo or something for them. Uh, wellness project. Oh, I forgot, we had to do like a, a business letterhead. So I did one for Winter Spring Pro and like stuff for like letters and the page and yeah cool next portfolio this was period d apparently not sure what that means okay so this is probably my first drawing and painting class or intro so oh this was with the hands and stuff so eventually you had to take the hands and paint them or something i don't freaking know this was a sunflower i drew with sharpie and what else? What else we got in here? Oh, okay, so we had to draw boxes. This is one I was obsessed with. I, I was obsessed with a lot of things, apparently. But this is one I really liked to be drama. So, I drew the rocket ship with these two boxes. The Planet Express ship, you might say. This is the back. Okay, so these are all pretty lame and boring pictures. I don't know, I feel like art class was like, pretty boring until you got to the fun projects like painting and stuff like learning the basics is boring and no one wants to do that oh we had to do a thing I was terrible at this it's supposed to look like the papers coming out but no this was learning shading I was very bad at shading and stuff uh, I don't know it actually kind of looks like it a little bit that the papers coming out you guys let me know did it work Oh, okay, let's get into the... Oh, yes! Okay, so these were my favorite things to use. Uh, oil pastels. This was just, like, practice oil pastel and stuff. But then we had... I uh, Remember that tree I said look out for? We had to make a tree out of uh, oil pastels. And this is the one I came up with. It's kind of... Is it Van Gogh? Is that who it is? So this one was actually put in a museum near my town and stuff, or like state, somewhere in my state it was put in a museum. Oh, this is one. Okay, so um, with paint, we had a canvas and we got a word and mine was toxic. So this is what I came up with with toxic. Pretty cool. Okay, let's see what else we got in here. Nothing good, nothing good. Oh. Here's me clenching an apple. This was with watercolor. I, I really like watercolor painting, but um, I, I'm not that great at it, but I enjoy it. I'm, I'm, I kind of like don't layer as much as I should when I watercolor, so it kind of is just like I'm acrylic painting, and I'm just like, oh, here, the darker the better, instead of like actually layering upon layering. And this was a self-portrait I had to do, but it got towards the end of the year, so I didn't get to finish, but... uh. <laughs> I look crazy. Okay. Uh, yeah. 
Um, I think that's really all I have for my art stuff. Nothing really else, but, or that I can find right now. But, um, yeah. Painting and drawing was a passion of mine at one time, and I, I like to, like, do it sometimes, like, randomly. I think I made that Pikmin, like, a few months ago, but, I don't know, I like to get more into painting and stuff again. Just because I feel like the more you do it, the better you get, obviously. And I feel like if I kept going, it could have been a lot better, but I stopped, and now I just... I'm just not as good as I used to be. Okay, so my question to you is, is there ever a time where you gave up on something that you could have eventually probably been good at and you kind of regret giving up on it? Me, it's painting and quitting gymnastics, so... Could have been a lot better. You could have been amazing. Amazing! But I gave up. So, um, yeah, that's it for today's video. I will see you guys tomorrow. May the odds be ever in your favor, and I'm just gonna say that anyways. Oh, and also, the winners to all the thing, the contest, are down below. But if the people don't respond to me, I will choose new winners. So, there is still hope. I will see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> He's going down. Oh! <laughs>